Hi everyone, my name is Steph, this is Little Bookish Teacher, and today I'm here to review book 18 in the Bad Guy series, Look Who's Talking. I meant to review this as soon as it came out. It has only just recently come out, so I think I'm fairly close to it. This story was really interestingly placed. So if you are familiar with the Bad Guy series, we're now 18 books in, we've had a lot of reveals. There was a very surprise ending to the last book that affected one of probably the beloved characters of the series in a way that we weren't expecting, and it revealed other things that are going on, which obviously I don't want to spoil. This book in particular is about us getting to know Rhonda. Through the series so far, Rhonda really hasn't spoken, so we don't know a lot about her. And this is where we find out exactly what's going on. And in a lot of ways, this book felt a bit like a recap book because a significant portion of it is spent going back over things that have happened in previous episodes and figuring out how Rhonda fit into it and how other characters have played into her role in order to support her. And of course, this includes her relationship with Agent Fox and also Wolf's relationship with Agent Fox. And I think in many ways, this is really telling of Aaron Blaby's storytelling style in this series. It is a book that is very aware of itself. It's always talking to the reader. It's always referencing things that are going on in the world. It's playing on the fact that older readers of this series, and in particular adults who might be reading it to younger readers, will be very aware of what he's doing. So it does have that fascinating multi-layered, multi-appeal storytelling approach. And by sort of recapping in this way, it gives readers an opportunity to recenter, or if someone just randomly picks this up, an opportunity to center themselves in the story and then also highlight sort of what we think is going to be coming in the in the future, which includes the showdown between two good friends and also the showdown between the big bad and the greater good or the one in this series. As always, there's plenty of humor. The art style in here is really entertaining. It reads very quickly and there's a lot going on in the pages. And of course, you can never quite trust that anyone who's gone is truly gone and that people won't just appear when you least expect it. So yeah, it was really interesting to come back to this and to read it and to continue the series. And I'm looking forward to seeing what happens in episode 19 and, and where Aaron Blaby's gonna take the story. In the comments, I'd love to know if you have caught up on the series or if you're planning on catching up anytime soon. If you just wanna let me know that you're here but you don't leave a comment, feel free to leave a wolf emoji down below. Otherwise, I hope that wherever you are in the world, you're staying safe and healthy and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye everyone.